The following is a transcript between Matthias De Stefano, referred to as me, and his higher self, referred to as I Am, originally produced on February 8, 2021, under the constellation of Aries, in the mental week, examining through the ankle chakra. I Am, now that your journey has begun, you must take one step at a time and be very careful in each one of them, because you only have 12 steps to take, and if you miss one of them, you must repeat the 12 again another time. Me, it's a huge weight and responsibility. I am. It all depends on how you take life. As we said yesterday, each one carries the load that they are willing to bear, which has manifested according to their paths, choices, and possibilities. Each one is a hero of their own tragedy, and they adapt according to the manifestations of their spirit, the needs of their being, or conditions of his soul and body. No one can be saved from his personal misfortune, which can only collaborate with each other and extend a hand, but the strength to get out of the well can only be exerted by the will of the person inside it. And we've all been there, in different ways, physically, emotionally, or mentally, we've been through the path of tragedy. But you know what? Me. What? I am. It is the conflict that nourishes your ability to create, just as polarity generates options, creates realities, opposites attract. That is how you manage to move forward. By generating friction, you generate energy. Freedom does not lie at the moment the conflict ends, but at the moment I integrate the tools that it has generated for me. You must ask yourself what each conflict gives you, and so you will know its reason for being. The individual who buries himself is his own conflict does not advance and experiences misfortune more than tragedy. Me, what's the difference? I am. The tragedy comes from the Greek word trago, goat or ram, and audi, song and refers to the Greek celebrations in which a sacrifice was made to the god Dionysus to celebrate the good times after the hard effort, commemorating himself by killing this animal publicly and watering the earth with its blood. Me, a real tragedy. I am. The theater was part of this celebration, and for this reason the heroic tales were related to the bellowing of the goat when dying, connected to the sorrows of the heroes. Meanwhile, a misfortune is to be lacking in grace, lacking in praise, something or someone who does not deserve to be honored for their inabilities or lack of gifts. They preferred the tragic suffering of a hero to the insipid life of a useless man. Me, it makes sense, but I don't understand the meaning of this in Aquarius. I am, it is the transforming path. Just as Capricorn, the methodology of work and sense of insufficiency in it are the constant keys to improvement. For Aquarius, it is transformation, overcoming levels, finding something new, an adventure that implies renewal and drives them to be different me, the path of the hero, but in this case, the Aquarian mind, it is the path that makes it transcend itself and transform itself at each step of its journey in a new adventure. I am, each step you take will be a key to renewing your essence. Me, why 12 steps? I am, because your body is a trinity, your soul is another trinity, your spirit is another trinity, and your being is is a trinity. 3, 3, 3, 3 equals 12. To join them, you have to go through them. Me, and what are they? I am. The body trinity refers to music, biology, and geometry. Aspects of creation considered the foundations of a body. The trinity of the soul is related to its attributes, love, wisdom, and will. The trinity of the spirit is the mental principles of the subconscious, unconscious, and conscious, while the being unifies them all in the trinity of vibration, energy, and matter. Each trinity is related to an element, being the body, the earth, the soul, the water, 
and the fire, the spirit, and the essence is the air. In order to find balance between all parties, they follow a path of expression, experimentation, integration, and transcendence, which must be manifested in twelve great tests. Me, the labors of Hercules, I am. In Greek mythology, the path of initiation was adopted as a path of the hero and Hercules. Hercules, which meant glory of Hera, mother goddess, wife of Zeus, embodied his story perfectly. Being the son of Zeus and a human, this hero was a demigod. Jealous, the mother of all gods, she made that character go crazy and kill all of his family, which destroyed the being leading him into exile after realizing what he had done. There, his sisters convinced him to go to the Oracle of Delphi, where they advised him that in order to heal his being, he should do what King Eurystheus, who took his place on the throne, told him to do. Me, and he ordered him to do ten jobs, one for each month, although Hercules ended up doing twelve because he had time to spare, twelve like the months of the ancient Egyptian and Mesopotamian calendar. I am, one, kill the Nemean lion, two, Kill the Hydra of Lerna. 3. Capture the Doe of Serenia. 4. Capture the Erymanthian boar alive. 5. Clean the Augean stables. 6. Expel the Symphalian birds. 7. Tame the Cretan bull. 8. Still the mares of Diomedes. 9. Steal Hippolyta's belt. 10. Still Gerion's cattle. 11. Still the golden apples from the garden of Hesperides. 12. Kidnap the dog of Severus from the underworld. Are you ready to know the steps of the path of your transformation? Me, I think so. I am. Let's start. Me, kill the Nemean lion. <laughs> I am. The lion had a very thick skin and it was impossible to be pierced by any spear or sword, and it devoured everything it found. Hercules tried for days to defeat the lion, and it was all in vain since his skin was impermeable. Then he decided to surprise him in his cave, and with the strong arms he strangled him, the lion, his ego, and his pride, our dark shadow. No one can defeat this beast more than oneself a beast that is difficult to kill by cutting its skins because they will protect us if we know how to take control of the situation. The cave is the innermost part of being and it has two entrances, one confused, full of emotions, and the other open to reason in order to subdue the beast that is inside. This task is to connect to the first month, to Leo, who awakens strength and power, which governs ourselves, and the key here is to replace selfishness with altruism. Me, kill the Lurian Hydra, I am. In Lerna, there were horrible swamps where monstrous Hydra lived. The mythological snake with nine heads, giant, with very hard scales, poisonous breath that gave off toxic gases. To get her out of her cave, he smothered the arrows with burning pitch and shot them into the cave where the monster was hiding. Coming out, Hercules destroyed her heads with the shovel, but new heads emerged from her, and he managed to defeat her by burning her wounds like scars preventing them from growing again. This story talks about all the low emotions based on grudges, on fleeting victories that feed the ego, and they represent immense obstacles in the path of those who wish to conquer themselves. It is fighting one's own interior, where negative thoughts and desires lie that emerge when eliminating another. The fire of the spirit is the only thing capable of bringing clarity to these matters. Of course, the hydra cannot be other than Scorpio. The sign rules death and transformation, which occurs when we eliminate the darkness. 
The hydra represents the repetitiveness of our mistakes. For this reason, it is essential to identify them, renouncing repetitive actions, innovating. Me, capture the doe of Cyrenia. I am, with this golden antlers and bronze hooves, Hercules had to capture her and transfer her to the Temple of the Sun. The goddess Artemis and Diana claimed ownership of the hind. It took our hero quite some time to capture her, as the goddesses confused him to thwart his hunt for her. Hercules chased her and captured her while she was drinking water. The request implied not to shed her blood, so he injured her by a tendon. The doe represents the unconscious and history of the soul, that which is hidden. Pursuing her is looking for what is inside her, the search for wisdom and improvement. The goddess who claimed her represents her desire and mentality, both awakening intuition, related to Cancer's maternal hunch and his sensitivity. Me, capture the Mount Erymanthian boar. I am, in this case, you should not kill the boar, but rather capture it. This was a creature that wreaked havoc, destroying crops, attacking towns, and making residents sick. After drunken fun with centaurs, which ended in a tragic battle, he found the boar, which he cornered by tying it with chains. Despite having fallen into the hands of Hercules, the animal represents the cunning of knowing how to handle the senses. The search for balance in what is felt, reminiscence of Libra, justice the balance in the domain of passions to achieve inner harmony. Me, cleaning the stables of King Ogeus. I am, Ogeus was a king of Elis, the son of the sun god. He owned cattle that never got sick, making his the best in all of Greece. The task of cleaning the stables was aimed at the humiliation of the hero. Due to the amount of excrement, Hercules opted for an easy solution divert the rivers, and have them drag everything downstream. Be in the stables everything dirty from the subconscious. Aquarius acts here as the one who purges, cleanses, and clarifies this hidden part, used wisely the power of the waters to clear the conscious. Me, scare away the bird of Stymphalus. I am the birds that inhibited Lake Stymphalus were carnivorous, and they had beaks and talons and wings of bronze. In addition, their droppings were poisonous and therefore ruined their crops. He tried to kill them with the arrows, but there were too many of them and he couldn't. He set a trap, but it didn't work either. He remembered that Athena had given him a gift that emitted sound, and when he made the sound, the birds fled in flocks forever from the place due to the noise they generated. These birds were a punishment for evil deeds, only capable of being transcended by the sound of wisdom. Only the ability to reflect, you can shake the world to clear the vision, become aware. This adventure of wisdom and eliminating the noises of the mind is typical of Sagittarius, who seeks wisdom, higher knowledge, and philosophy. In this sign, he learns to discriminate between the fair and what is unfair, the real from what is unreal. Me, capture the Cretan bull, I am. The wild beast breathed fire from its nostrils and wreaked havoc on Crete. Poseidon had him pulled out of the waters toward the islands of Crete when King Minos promised to sacrifice to the gods. But the king wanted to keep the animal for its beauty, and because of this, Poseidon forced his wife to have relations with the bull, giving rise to the Mentator. In order to subdue him, Hercules grabbed his horns and mounted him, directing his impulses, and he returned it to the sea. Like the emotions themselves, this bull is governed by instincts and impulses, representing the insatiable desire of the ego and the world of material illusion. Taurus is thus the constellation that embodies this attachment 
to the emotional illusion of matter. Me, release the mares of Diomedes. I am Diomedes, king of Thrace. Had some mares that ate human flesh, and sometimes he would feed them with his guests. Hercules had to still them and take them to his king. He cornered these wild mares into a field where there was no more room for them to move, and there he caught and bound them. But they devoured his friend who helped him, and they escaped. So he had no other option than to dig a channel and flood it, the waters of the sea, trapping them there. The ferocious mares represents the wrong thoughts and words and the wrong ideas that generate forces that cause war and devastation. Learning here is to master the runaway mind, something typical of Ares, who devours the world with his low egoic passions or starts life with all of his power. Me, obtain Hippolyta's belt. I am. Hippolyta was the queen of the Amazons, a tribe of women. She herself had a belt that had been given to her by Ars, the god of war. Hercules tried to make her fall in love, but it was impossible, and for this reason he kidnapped her sister, asking for her belt as a reward. This symbolizes feminine power, virginity, and chastity. Hercules does not understand that the belt, a symbol of union, bond, and love, cannot be conquered or stolen. Only by integrating his feminine and masculine polarity could she have achieved the goal. Thus, Virgo is the key to this test, cultivating tolerance, compassion, and charity, virtues that will allow us to be progressively more inclusive and loving. Me, still Geryon's cattle. I am. The giant Geryon was a monster with human faces. He had one body and three heads. He owned a two-headed dog and a flock that was protected by the dog and by a shepherd. Hercules pointed his bow to Helios, the sun, who left the golden boat at his disposal to cross the ocean of Irida. Once on the giant's islands, he put all the cattle on the boat. Gerion set out in search of him, but Hercules killed him with a single arrow that pierced the three of his bodies. This is the death of the personality and the liberation of the soul, typical of Pisces, who transcends starting a new cycle, dissolving the material to amplify the divine. Me. Still the apples from the Garden of Hasperides. I am. In the Garden of the Hasperides, there is a tree that gives the golden apple that provides immortality. The Hasperides and the hundred-headed dragon, Loudon, have the task of taking care of the apple tree in the garden. At last, the father of the Hasperides is tricked by Hercules into taking one of the apples, while Hercules would hold the sky. When Atlas returned with the apple, he does not want to keep holding the sky, but Hercules tricks him again and asks him to hold the sky for a moment while he puts his cape on his shoulders. In this way, Hercules took the apple and finished his work. In this work, Hercules does not use brute force, but his power of conviction and intelligence. The tree represents the tree of knowledge, good and evil, which is full of apples of wisdom. Gemini is activated here with the ability to solve from the mind and cunning. Me, capture Cerberus in hell. I am. At his last job, Eurystheus commissioned Hercules to face death itself, to go down to hell and to bring Cerberus before him, the dog with the three heads and the snake tail that was in charge of guarding the entrance of the underworld. To achieve this, Hercules went to Hermes to help him go down to the underworld. There, he asked Persephone and Hades himself to lend him Cerberus. He chained the ferocious animal and pulled it out of the abyss and went to show it to his mistress, 
Eurystheus, but later, frightened and seeing that it was capable of anything, finally decided to grant the hero freedom, who returned the dog to hell. This task leads us to Capricorn, to face the temptations of matter, descends to the underworld in an act of purification. In this work, Hercules must overcome the deepest fears of his failure in the face of a possible defeat of the magnanimous ambition of this feat. Me, and so he completes all the steps. I am. These stories only narrate what many cultures have been describing as the steps of an individual to become wise and divine being on earth. Of course, the myth of the twelve labors of Hercules does not have a logic except for understanding the metaphysics of its narration. No matter the order in which you decide to walk the path, your feet will lead you to learn, to educate yourself in the path of full consciousness, where the physical, emotional, and mental aspects will be put to the test. Me, I am noticing. I feel like I have to start facing these tests. I am. That is why I want to tell you about them today, so that you will recognize them when you stand before them. But don't worry. Soon our path of the soul will begin, and there we will travel one by one, step by step, and we will carry out together the test that you recognize here today from your mind. Me. Ah. Oh. I am not liking Aquarius. I thought it would be different. I am. What you must integrate cannot be easy. In the challenge is the glory. In the conflict is the evolution. In the error is the learning. You just have to dare to be wrong, to face your monsters, and together we will do the rest. Do you dare? Me, yes, I'm ready. I am. Welcome to the path of the hero. Let's get started. Awesome. Awesome.